What's up, everybody? Big Will, K-Pop for Life, coming back at you. And uh, we're about to have another episode of K-Pop Rants. So these days, I find myself wondering, YG, what the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> I know I'm not the only one. So if you didn't know, today, uh, Blackpink dropped their uh, teaser trailer for Forever Young, and they're slowly doing the slowly, you know, moving photo things. If you haven't seen it, let me pop it on real quick. So there's one with Jisoo and one with Rosé, and they're just like moving poster things, but if you haven't seen it, you're living under a rock, but it's 20 seconds, so hold on. It sounds like it could be hot. I'm gonna reserve my judgment because teaser videos often lie, but it sounds like it could be hot. My only question, my only question, arguably, this is your biggest group, YG, right? This is your biggest group. So tell me, Mr. YG and all of the brilliant people at your facility running things, why the hell on your YouTube page, your official YG Entertainment YouTube page that you can see right here on my screen, why the actual hell is Zion T. Snow from six months ago on the top as the channel banner song video thing that you can put on here? Nobody cares about Zion T, especially six months later when Blackpink has a new album Finally, an actual album, kind of. It's only four. It should be six for a mini album, which is also confusing. Coming out in like seven, eight days. But no, no, come down. Come come with me on the adventure down the YG Entertainment page to prove to you the stupid decisions presently being made at YG Entertainment. Boom. Why the hell are they all the way down here? They're below Winner, Icon, and then Blackpink. Like, listen, I like Winner, and I like Icon, but Blackpink is more popular than any of them, all right? At least among international fans. I can't speak to the Korean fans. I don't live in Korea. I don't know. But it's Blackpink. They're not in your area, apparently, YG. They're three sections down when these teasers should be on the top of your channel. Nobody cares about Zion T six months later. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with YG Entertainment? What is happening there? I feel like a lot of crazy decisions have been made. I gave you the benefit of the doubt. If you watch one of my videos before or a live stream I had, it came up and I was like, you know what? No, YG is a good businessman. He knows what he's doing. He's trying to build these girls up as like these sort of demigod figures, making people just want and crave more. And I feel like I was wrong. And I have no problem admitting that. I feel like you don't know what the hell you're doing sometimes. <laughs> if you're watching this, like, I'm not trying to be offensive. Also, why are you watching this? Don't you have, like, other things to do? Like, I don't know, promote Blackpink? I don't understand the business decisions that have been made. I feel like a lot of these big uh, Korean record labels that got really, really big, SM, YG, and JYP, and between like first and second gen where they made a lot of their money and they got a lot of their fame uh, off the backs of groups like Girls' Generation, 21, um, and, and groups like that from, from all the, the big three record labels, right? I feel like they got lucky because they all seem to just make really dumb decisions for the most part, uh, with the exception sometimes of SM Entertainment. And I don't understand why you would take a property a, a money-making machine like Blackpink that only has five songs and is as popular as they are, which is insane, and not milk the hell out of it like JYP is doing to twice. At least he's smart enough to do that. I don't know. I don't know. All I know is I cannot wait for this comeback, and I wish that J uh, YG would get behind and really support them and promote them. I don't know if it's because he's broke and he's just penny pinching. I don't know what the deal is, but I'm curious to know what you guys think in the comments below. If you like what you see and you want to see more, click one of the two links that's going to pop up in a second here. And as always, keep on popping, K-poppers. Remember, it's not a trend. It's a lifestyle. Deuces. It's